Hi, my name is Arlen Taylor and I'm the Chief of Operations for Cedarcrest Trout Farm. Today I would like to show you what it takes for us to get 500,000 eggs. Today we received a million eggs from Trout Lodge. They come in from Seattle, Washington. They come through uh, British Columbia and they come into a Toronto Airport. There we have an extensive permitting process and we pick them up. Um, today 500,000 went to our other hatchery which is located 10 kilometers from here and another 500,000 came here. So in each of these trays we have approximately 50,000 and of these eggs they are eyed eggs which are the easiest for transport. At this point in time in their life stage they are basically little ping pong balls. You can see them moving within their eggs and showing very good signs of life. These eggs come in a box packed with ice and they are transported. It takes 24 hours for them to get here to my farm. They can be in the boxes for up to 72 hours. Once the boxes arrive here, we have to acclimatize them. They come in at a temperature of two to four degrees. Today, our, ours came at four degrees. We have to make them come to the water temperature that we have here, which is nine degrees. So this will take approximately three hours for us to do safely. We'll sprinkle water over them every 15 to 30 minutes and make sure that the temperature is coming up appropriately. Once this is done, we'll store them in the incubators here at a quantity of approximately 15,000 per tray. In these trays, they will stay until they hatch. And after that period of time, they will also spend approximately two weeks resting, at which point in time they will absorb about 90% of their yolk sac before we move them into troughs. We like to get Trout Lodge all females because our clients ask for them as well as the fact that these will have about a 97% survival rate for us at our farms.